Hey guys, it's Lindsay with Emeralds and Fairy Lights. I'm here today for an unboxing of Dime Moon Shop. So I know I just recently did one of these and it seems like I just have bought a ton of paintings, but there's a little bit of an explanation about this. Um, the last painting, um, you should go check that out. I'm going to be um, working on and completing four of the small sizes available uh, of certain images to see if their smallest size is worth the cost and if it's a good way to save money on some of these gorgeous paintings that Dime Moon Shop has. So the other thing though is I mentioned on my channel that my husband is a tax accountant and um, he had told me that because it's been a struggle for both of us um, this busy season we had said okay I can get um, a reward at the end of busy season for not losing my mind. Um, so the tax deadline got extended and um, I just said, I don't care. I'm just buying this. And so I bought it. <laughs> it was just a little bit of a, like a consolation prize. Like I can do this. I can last till May 17th. So anyway, I ordered it so that I could have it, um, by the tax deadline. So let's look at this. Of course, Dime Moon Shop has this beautiful packaging. I've um I've taken off the plastic wrap that it comes in. Don't worry, it comes in a lot, it's shipped in a lot better than just this, this paper. So I think you always hate ripping into it because it's so pretty. Well, I don't want to waste your time. Like, all of it at once so I'm just going to get to it because I'm excited to see these things. Um, as, I, as I stated in my other unboxings, Dye Moon Shop is a bit of a luxury shop just because they have really gorgeous licensed diamond paintings but these diamond paintings are made to order, so you have to wait. They're not already made, just sitting in a warehouse for you. Um, so you get to pick the size, what kind of drills you want, all that jazz, um, and then um, they make it for you. So I picked three paintings that were all in the largest sizes that they have available. I really just liked these ones. And at the time that I bought, I bought this, they had a promotion going. Um, it was buy three paintings, get a free Zooey tube. So I did get a free Zooey tube. I believe the paintings are in the tube. That's cute. I've never seen heart bubble wrap. Have you guys? <laughs> I've never seen that before. That's cute. Of course, save this bubble wrap for James because what is better than a whole sheet of bubble wrap for a toddler to jump around on? It's things like that in life that just make your day, you know, when you're a little kid. Try not to pop any. Looks like we got a good amount. A good amount for popping for James. So I think these are, these are the retractable ones that they can be, like you can make them as long um, or as, as you know, like the, the length that you need. And it looks like I got this painting. This is an Anna Dittman. And this is a gorgeous painting. Um, I, I'm i curious about this one. Um, I just, it, it's on my, my to get list at some point, but you know. So we've got, looking at this, we have our little stickers, They're our gift that comes with. Um, the special treatments this time came in special envelopes. So I have um, for my three paintings and then I they also sent me um, special treatments 
for my Sarah painting that um, I already have those in my last unboxing to add to it. So these are my throws. And then it looks like this is my toolkit. I've got two toolkits, I guess. So I have got a whole ton of pens and wax and tweezers in this one. And then in this one, I've got a whole bunch of green and white boats and some whole collection of multi-placers. So that's neat. I didn't know that they like increased by the amount of orders that you bought. So here is my other bag. And then this is um, comes with your tube, I think, so that you can carry it, which is neat. I'll be going on vacation soon, and so maybe I'll have to use my Julie tube. Um, let's go ahead and look at these candy bags. one that I thought was so neat. <gasps> you see? Naga. Okay, so let me pull these and just quickly roll them backwards so you can see them um, better. Because these are poured glue canvases, they do um, flatten out very easy and you can roll them backwards without ruining the painting. Um, I haven't ever had any problem with a diamond shop canvas not sitting flat, so um, they will lay flat just of their own accord while after having been laid out. Um, I didn't quite roll that one back, but I think it's flat enough at the moment. So this is called Naga, and it is by, um, why am I blanking at the moment? Okay, <laughs> it is by Leoba Bruck Bruckner, I think. Is that how you say it? Yeah, she's one of my favorite artists, and for some reason, my mind just went completely blank there. So, um, this is just so pretty, and um, I think her hair is so mesmerizing. Let's take a look at, oh, look at, that is a lot of color blocking going on in her hair. I kind of wondered from my last, is that focusing very well? Um, if their pieces were going to just all be confetti regardless of the image, but this looks like there's actually a lot of color blocking in it. Um, I think these dragons are so cool. Um, I know Naga means dragon and it can mean water dragon and some fantasy stuff. So I'm assuming that's what this is. Um, behind her but it is so cool I love how she draws Leoba Bruckner draws like she'll have like a, a person that just stands out in the image and then the background is beautiful too I don't know it's just it's just gorgeous I love that there's this white butterfly here um, I might try to get to this um, during the butterflies with diamonds I, I really I struggle <laughs> Um, event because I've already finished mine for that but we'll see um, and then there's another one too that has a butterfly so you'll see that one but this one I will show you the drills so I did do this in round is this focusing? I need to flip this over I don't know why my camera is not wanting to focus great but um here are our colors so there are 45 colors and this is a 69 by 60 i'll show you the special treatments that come with it 
Okay, sorry, I'm not really sure why my phone was struggling, but so we've got the Alexandrite. So we're gonna sprinkle on the dark and blue areas in the background, dragon scale on the dragon's body. It's gonna be pretty. Chili on areas of the dragon, and then snow on the white areas, which I think it's primarily her hair and her, um, the butterfly. So I, I think they sprinkled this, this snow in her hair and then the butterfly. So that will be really pretty with that, that gold accent on the dragon and then the blue just in the swirls because like I said, I do think it is a water dragon. So that is neat. Okay, let's go ahead and look at the next painting, which is also a Leova Bruckner. got Subaki. Um, this one is just caught my eye. This, <laughs> I really liked, I think was this in the Fab February? Um, I think this was one of the Fab February releases and I really liked it, but, um, I was getting small and I didn't want to get this one in, in the smallest size available. So I caught it for one of my rewards. And it is 60 by 65, it's 45 colors. And let's look at these drills. Let's see, I'm not gonna take them out because they're so nicely packaged. Then I will show you her special treatments. So her special treatments are these gems. So there's just a few. And then we have chili and avocado. Um, so these, these special drill treatments um, for this painting and the next painting were actually not very expensive. They were only $8, I believe. So I think definitely reasonable for a painting this size. Um, the chili is going to go in her dress and in her hair, um, or the, the flower in her hair. The avocado is going to go in this butterfly. And then the pearls are going to go on her earrings. Or I guess if that's the thing that's hanging down and then her... Is that her earrings? I'm not really sure. But I think that's where the pearls are supposed to go. Now, I think there's lots of things that you could do with this one. You could definitely enhance the blue bird that is sitting on her head. Can you see that? Um, yeah, there's lots of fun things, but um, this looks great. And the symbols honestly look good to me. The skin hopefully will turn out a little bit better than the Queen War Red. But, you know, I think the good thing in doing paintings, the more you do, the more you can see things happening before they happen. And then you can correct course. <laughs> makes any sense but honestly the rendering of their paintings is what really draws me to them because they do have a style of their paintings that is so beautiful so let's put Subaki down now this last one is gonna look familiar because I bought the smaller size of this and um, I actually wanted to do a comparison video along with the smaller sizes with a large version of one of them to really give you an idea of the difference between the small and large size. So this is the one that I got in the largest size and this is huge. Holy Hannah. <laughs> this is huge. Now she is gorgeous. 60 by 76 and maybe she just looks giant because I have the smaller one but yeah her eyes are <laughs> large so yeah we've got like a huge huge painting um 
she she is so gorgeous i said in my other video i didn't know that she was from labyrinth but i think she's so gorgeous and um being a dark haired blue eyed person i love seeing pictures of dark haired blue eyed people <laughs> It's one of those things where it's like you just don't see that combination often and so when you do see a pretty painting so um i really did like this one how she had such pretty blue eyes with her dark hair now i know that it's jennifer Connolly is is kind of who the model or who the actress is and so yeah it totally makes sense and this is margaret morales's version of of her but just such a gorgeous painting um Again, these symbols are looking really good. Let's look at the drills, though, and see. I don't see anything that looks too confusing. There are 45 colors. Now, one thing I do wish that Die Moon Shop would do is I think it's nice that they include this separate legend. But I do wish that they would do these a little bit larger um, just because I think that they become so small and on the legend they can be difficult to read. These ones I don't see a problem with, um, but sometimes they can be difficult. I think especially on these larger shapes like the heart and the clover, it can look a little bit blurred. Um, this N... Um, I mean, they're all, you can see them all on here. You can tell what they are. So it's not bad enough um, on one of the last paintings, not from Die Moon Shop, where I couldn't read the legend. Um, but let's look at her special treatments. So what have we got in here? Is some electric for the jewelry ice on her earrings and then sprinkle in the lightest areas of her dress so let's flip her around and see that's going to be really pretty so we're gonna have this in her jewelry that's going to oh that's going to sparkle and then this blue in her earrings and then white in her dress on the white parts so it's gonna be really pretty so um that takes us to the end of this unboxing. I'm really excited to work on these. You guys, I have like so many paintings that I just want to work on and I just want like days to work on diamond painting. I want a diamond painting vacation where I can just diamond paint to my heart's content. <laughs> Maybe someday. Maybe someday. But anyway, I will see you guys in another video. Bye.